The sun was shining this morning for the longest day of the year, so we sent Sally to Stonehenge, but not the one that immediately springs to mind. In Hilly Fields Park in Lewisham, there's also a circle of rocks dating back 400 million years, a tribute act to the real thing. But they've only been in South East London for just over 20 years. A perfect place for yoga, chatting and coffee, all very much in Sally's skill set. While Stonehenge had parties this morning, Stone Circle had serenity. Although it's not always like this for the solstice, apparently. One year there was people all dancing naked <laughs> on the stones. <laughs> but mainly it's become a destination. If you want to know where to come, they'll say meet at the Stone Circle. Unlike Stonehenge, Stone Circle is a mere baby. It was built in the millennium for the community, for meetups, for quite frankly anything. And yes, you can climb it preferably with your clothes on, but it also has another very useful job. So, mm. Juliet, this is a sundial, right? Yes, we think it's called analomatic. <laughs> OK, big word. <laughs> and you've got the months written down here. Here's yes. June, and that there and says here's the solstice. the solstice today, 21st. And, and how does it work? That's noon, you said. Yes, so the sun, say at 2 o'clock, sends your shadow off towards 2 o'clock. That's amazing. And what time is it? 2.27. That yeah. is pretty good. Yes, because it's just gone past 2 o'clock that, as well. That's right, yes. That's yeah. very cool, I like uh, that. But it was a mission to build, with the stones coming all the way from Scotland. They're called glacial pebbles, although <laughs> if you see the size of them, they're not what you or I might call pebbles, but that's what say, they are. understatement of the century. Yes, yes. <laughs> Now, as it turns out, there was actually a bit of a party here last night. What was going on? There was some music going on. My mate was doing the music. I kind of chilled around that bit more, but there was so many different activities I couldn't keep up. But some locals were up <laughs> for a different reason. <laughs> so which of these guys was awake for sunrise this morning? Yeah, Teddy was definitely awake for sunrise this morning, weren't you, Ted? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think we'll forgive him. Sometimes it's worth getting up, no matter what time it is. <laughs> They're a bit smaller than yeah. the real the last Stonehenge. One was big. <laughs> <laughs> if you get it from the right angle. Get the right angle.